it's unacceptable. That's my that's my reaction. It's unacceptable, and we got to we got to solve that. We got to stop it. 5:30 now, and there's a new chief in charge. Akron's new police chief just started, and he's facing several battles as he begins. We're talking primarily the violence on the streets of his city. Have a look at this. In 2020, there were 50 murders over the course of the year, which was considered high. But already this year, there have been 34. So what's the department's newest leader's plan for cutting down on all this violence? News 5's Bob Jones sat down with the new chief to get some answers. Steve Milet moved 2,400 miles from Bellevue, Washington to Akron to take the job as Akron's top cop. He's now in charge of a department that has investigated 84 murders in two years, compared to eight murders during the same time period in the West Coast city he came from. This is a community violence issue that we need to end now. A week into the job in Milet is focused on the violence plaguing Akron. Through July of this year, there have been 71 documented shooting incidents in the city, including murders, felonious assaults, and discharging guns. Of the 34 murders in 2021, 31 of the victims died from gunfire, with 16 cases solved. All of last year, Akron saw 50 murders, 36 were killed by guns, and 38 cases were solved. It's unacceptable. That's my, that's my reaction. It's unacceptable. And we gotta, we gotta solve that. We gotta stop it. I do so pledge. I do so pledge. Following a ceremonial swearing in, Milat sat down with News 5 and said he's evaluating what the department can specifically do to curb the violence. It's gonna take me just a little bit to find out exactly what we're doing, what's worked, what hasn't worked. Uh, and I am not above stealing and ripping off other police departments and their ideas and, and customizing them to the needs of our local community. Something the chief plans to do very soon is meet with faith-based leaders. I am going to be reaching out next week to several of the uh, uh, faith-based leaders and um, find out what the relationship is. Milet stressed fixing the serious problem goes beyond police and church groups. He said help is needed from residents, businesses, and school districts too. We need to identify what is leading one human being to look at another and pull the trigger. The chief says he took the job in part because of Akron's affordability and a strong connection between the government and the people. But he also says there's work to be done to build up the trust with police and on social justice issues. Building that community trust and establishing legitimacy for us in people's lives is the work of our time. And when I say our time, chiefs of police and police departments. In Akron, Bob Jones, News 5.